Hey guys, I'm at the LCBMX warehouse. I will be signing some shirts this morning since a lot of you guys actually requested for me to sign a bunch of these. I will try my best. I think there's like a hundred shirts that I gotta sign this morning. That's gonna be kind of hard. It's my first time doing this many shirts. We are working on the version two of the design. So another design will be up. Sunday, I'm back at the shop. I'm gonna do something different with my bmw i already bought the e36 what i'm gonna do with this car is finish this one since it already runs but it has a blown head gasket and they install a clutch wrong so i'm gonna get my e46 has a e36 m3 swap with a turbo system that i fabricated for it so i'm gonna take that engine off today i'm gonna put it aside take the car home and then i'm gonna put the m3 swap in my e36 we're gonna go ahead and lift the car now to begin taking the bolts on the transmission mount and the motor mounts off then we're gonna pull the engine out remove the aftermarket shifter that i have on this car and remove the rear coilovers and wheels transmission mount off then you can swing back gonna start with the firewall after we see that it moves all the way back then we completely loosen the motor mount and it's ready to come out Okay, you're 
pickup mount on the back of the block and then you have this hook also on the front. You will need one of these because you need you can't just like balance it like a regular and it comes straight out. It has to come out at an angle so you have to be able to adjust the angle as you're getting it out of the engine. So we use one of these adjustable engine hoist brackets. Now we put the engine hoist on it. Oh, wait. First put some tension on it, then see where our angle is at. We want the engine to pick up on the front and then the transmission to drop so we can slide it out this way. You guys I wonder what I use for bushings. I like using this Refshit bushings. These are the hard compounds and they work really, really well. Front mass is out. Now we can just pull the engine forward. Come on, engine. Come with me. Let me lower a little bit. Here's the front. Let's go. Let's go. All the way. I left the ground. Stuck. I, I didn't get the ground off. It's still attached. You can just hold it there. It's fine. Um, that's not 13. Next step is to remove my racing shifter and we're good to go. We got the car loaded in the trailer. It's ready to go back home. The shop decided to stop at one of my favorite places to eat with my friend Jason. We also got a pretty cool server friend that we're waiting for to get a table. We love you, Stephanie. <laughs> this place is awesome. They got like all these cool TVs. They have all the best beer, super cool drinks. Great food, not to mention they also have the best mozzarella sticks ever. Okay, so we got our table, uh, we're waiting for our friend server. Hi Stephanie. Hi, so how's it going? We came all the way over here to this one just to get Stephanie to be our server. She's the she's the best. She's been like she's been awesome every time we came, so now we wait for her. I you guys should definitely to come to the Twin Peaks. It's the Altamont Twin Peaks. Yep. It's the best one in Santa Paula. Yep. I got my night chicken sandwich. He made it just the way I wanted it. After 30 minutes. And brought my honey monster sauce. Yeah. Look at that. Yes. Look at all that cheese. <laughs> Soon I'll be able to work on my car. Probably next week. And here is what's going to go in that car. BMW S52 M3 swap with big boost. I'm going to go ahead and end this video now uh, so I can get to editing. It's a lot of work. It's been a very busy week. And I've promised to make really good videos for you guys from now on. I got lots of content. It's going to be looking really good.